Hey guys, today's Lost Sector is Exodus Garden 2A in the Cosmodrome. There's going to be two overloads and two barriers. Moving on to the build, we're going to be using Stormcaller with Chaos Reach. With Healing Rift, you could use Empowering Rift if you want. Burst Glide, Ball Lightning, and Storm Grenades. Moving on to the Aspects, Electrostatic Mind makes us when we collect an Ionic Trace, it makes us Amplified. And Arc Soul will give us increased damage just for popping our Rift. Fragments, we're going to be using Spark of Beacons while we're Amplified our Arc Special Weapon Final Blows create a Blinding Explosion. Spark of Shock makes our Arc Grenades jolt targets. Spark of Discharge, Arc Weapon Final Blows have a chance to create an Ionic Trace. And Spark of Feedback, when we take melee damage, we deal more melee damage, but you could also go for a Spark of Ions instead. For the weapons, we're going to be using an Auto Rifle for the Barriers. I prefer one with Demolitionist, it'll just make it a little bit easier. A Grenade Launcher, mine is Salvenger Salvo with Demolitionist. Once again, this is the special weapon, you can get away with just about anything in this slot. And then the Vianthan Spreath, just for boss damage and champion damage. Moving on to the artifact mods, we're going to be using Thunder's Retort, which makes our super deal more damage if cast while amplified or critical. Electric Armor, which gives us increased damage resistance while amplified. And Nightly Strikes twice, after throwing an arc grenade, gain increased grenade recharge for a short time. Moving on to the mods, we are using a hybrid build, so we're going to have an Ashes to Assets as well as a Hands-On. I'm going to have an Arc Siphon mod for my Salvager Salvo. Moving on to the gloves, heavy handed and fire power. So we have two different avenues of orb generation through both types of abilities. All these orbs are going to be used to power emergency reinforcement, but it's also going to be used for innervation, invigoration, and recuperation. A powerful attraction on the mark will allow us to pick our orbs up with our rift. The exotic of choice today is Crown of Tempest. All right, getting started with the lost sector. We're just going to try to kill the servitor as quick as we can. You can use a Leviathan's breath shot on it if you want. Once we kill everything in this room, this doorway will open. Once we kill almost everything in this room, the barrier will come out. Once I pop a shield, I'm just going to shoot a Leviathan's breath at it. Once we kill the barrier, we need to start worrying about the next overload that spawns. Once we kill him and we keep moving forward, there'll be another overload. Right around this corner. I got my Chaos Reach so fast, I decided just to use it, see if I can get a second one this run. There will be another barrier here at the end of the tunnel. Watch out for the crates and visible hitboxes. In this room, we're just going to be trying to get back as much super energy as possible since we popped our Chaos Reach earlier. that servitor so I know it's almost time for the boss so I'm trying to get as many orbs as possible. I'm about nine tenths of the way to my super so I'm just going to shoot Leviathan Breath at the boss until the dregs walk up to me where I'll melee them and get enough energy for Chaos Reach. That's all there is to it today. Happy farming. 